Lyondal Basel Industries NV is a public multinational chemical company with American and European roots, incorporated in the Netherlands, with U.S. operations headquarters in Houston, Texas, and global operations in London, UK. The company is the largest licensor of polyethylene and polypropylene technologies. It also produces ethylene, propylene, polyolefins, and oxyfuels. Lyondell Basel was formed in December 2007 by the acquisition of Lyondell Chemical Company by Basel Polyolefins for $12.7 billion. As of 2016, Lyondell was the third largest independent chemical manufacturer in the United States. History Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Early History Since its establishment in 1985 from facilities belonging to the Atlantic Richfield Company Arco, the company grew through stock swaps with Occidental Chemicals and Millennium Chemicals in 1997 which formed Equistar Chemicals of which each entity were partners. Lyondell purchased the outstanding shares from each of its partners to gain total control of Equistar which is a wholly owned subsidiary of Lyondell. In 2004, Lyondell purchased Millennium Chemicals in a stock swap deal at $2.3 billion. In August 2006, Lyondell acquired Sitego's interest in the Lyondell Sitego refinery for $2.1 billion, and renamed the facility Houston Refining. Chemical maker Basil Polyolefins purchased Lyondell in December 2007, creating the new company Lyondell Basil Industries AFSCA, one of the largest chemical companies in the world at that time. It was owned by Access Industries, a privately held, U.S.-based industrial group. Lyondell Basel is the third largest independent chemical manufacturer in the world and is headquartered in London, United Kingdom. Expansion Lyondell Basel's United States operations filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection in January 2009 and emerged from bankruptcy in April 2010. The company was only under bankruptcy protection for 15 months. Its former parent company, Lyondell Basel Industries AFSCA was replaced by Lyondell Basel Industries NV. It was listed on the New York Stock Exchange on October 14, 2010. In 2012, one Houston center, the building housing Lyondell Basel's Houston headquarters since 1986, was renamed Lyondell Basel Tower. In 2014, Lyondell Basel announced that it was installing two large cracking furnaces at its Channelview plant, and the following year the company announced it would double production capacity at the Bayport Underwood plant. Lyondell Basel acquired the compounding assets of Xilog Plast Alloys, an India-based company, in November 2015. The acquisition made Lyondell Basel the third largest PP compounds producer in India. In June 2016, Lyondell Basel announced a factory in northern China. It was the third facility for Lyondell Basel to open in China, following Guangzhou and Suzhou. In September 2016, Lyondell Basel announced that it would build a $700 million polyethylene plant at the La Porte Manufacturing Complex on the Houston Ship Channel that would produce 1.1 billion pounds of polyethylene annually. The company started construction on a La Porte plant in May 2017. The company completed an expansion of its Corpus Christi ethylene plant in January 2017. The plant's capacity was increased by 50% to produce 2.5 billion pounds annually. That same year, Hurricane Harvey hit the United States and affected the company's Texas Gulf Coast operations. The Houston Ship Channel was temporarily closed, which prevented crude tankers from reaching refineries. 
The Laporte facility was damaged but came back online in late October. In December 2017, Lyondal Basel partnered with Suez, a French water and waste management company, in the first joint venture between a major plastics and chemicals company and a resource management company. Lyondal Basel and Odebrecht entered into exclusive talks for Lyondal Basel to acquire control of Brascom in June 2018. During July 2018, Lyondal Basel announced announced a partnership with Karlsruhe Institute of Technology in Germany to advance chemical recycling of plastic materials and assist the global efforts towards the circular economy and plastic waste recycling needs. The focus of the venture is to develop a new catalyst and process technology to decompose post-consumer plastic waste, such as packaging into monomers for reuse in polymerization processes. In August 2018, Lyondal Basel finalized their acquisition of A. Schulman Inc. in a $2.25 billion deal. That same month, it broke ground on the world's largest propylene oxide and tertiary butyl alcohol plant in Channelview, Texas. The plant is estimated to produce 1 billion pound of propylene oxide and 2.2 billion pounds of tertiary butyl alcohol annually. Lyondal Basel will export the majority of its products via the Houston Ship Channel. Lyondal Basel also announced in September that it and its joint partner, Covestro, kicked off a large investment project in Maasvlakte Rotterdam, the Netherlands. The Circular Steam project incorporates an innovative technology into the existing production plant to convert its water based waste into energy and is an important contribution to the Dutch government's CO2 reduction targets. Philanthropy <laughs> 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 Lyondal Basel holds an annual Global Care Day, where company employees volunteer for community service projects in 20 countries. Lyondal Basel raised $2.7 million for United Way in 2015. In 2016, Lyondal Basel raised $2.65 million across its 23 company sites for Victoria County United Way in Texas. At the time, it was the largest donation the organization had received. The following year, the company donated $54,424 to Victoria County United Way to support 18 partner agencies in the surrounding area. In April 2017, Lyondal Basel's Corpus Christi complex raised over $78,000 for United Way of the Coastal Bend which would benefit the Greenwood Molina Child Care Center. The complex had raised over $1.2 million in donations for United Way of the Coastal Bend since 1997. Lyondale Basel donated $100,000 to the Houston Fire Department in 2017 and also donated to the Italian Red Cross and Stadtfeuerwehrverband Köln Cologne Firefighters Association in Germany. In May 2017, Lyondale Basel became a corporate partner of the Astros Community Leaders Program which supports community youth baseball and softball leagues. In response to Hurricane Harvey in 2017, Lyondale Basel donated food to disaster relief efforts in the Gulf Coast region. Topic awards and recognition The American Chemistry Council recognized Lyondale Basel with its Responsible Care Company of the Year Award in 2014. In 2015, the American Heart Association recognized Lyondale Basel's Cincinnati Technology Center with the Fit Friendly Worksite Platinum Award. The Fit Friendly program emphasizes employee health and company culture surrounding physical health. Lyondale Basel was named number two on the list of top 25 foreign owned chemical producers by Chemical and Engineering News in both 2015 and 2016. In 2016, Houston Business Journal recognized Lyondal Basel as the third largest Houston based public company. CEO, Bob Patel was named number one in the ICIS Top 40 Power Players listing, published by ICIS Chemical Business Magazine. The ICIS Top 40 Power Players is a global annual ranking of the leading senior executives making the greatest positive impact on their companies and the industry. 
It is based on selections from the Global ICIS senior editorial staff. In 2018, Lyondell Basel was named to Fortune magazine's list of the world's most admired companies. Additionally, Bob Patel received the 2018 ICIS Cavalier Award in September. The winner of the ICIS Cavalier Award is selected by his, her peers, the senior executives of the ICIS Top 40 Power Players listing, a global ranking of the leaders making the greatest positive impact on their companies and the chemical industry published in ICIS Chemical Business Magazine. Topic: Manufacturing facilities. North American manufacturing facilities. South American manufacturing facilities. European manufacturing facilities. Asian manufacturing facilities. Australian facilities. <laughs> <laughs>